Hey, this is Dan from vhx411.com. Today I'll show you how to program 99 Rover, BMW, Mercedes, same uh, same thing. If you replace the ECU, this is original, we marked it original. You bought a new one because the original is bad, flooded. Uh, you'll have to open it up in order for you to start the car. There's a little chip over here. You'll have to heat it up with a heat gun. Before you heat it up, you will have to mark it number one. That's location of the EEPROM. So if you can read numbers from left top to right, if you can read the numbers, this will be your number one. That way when you solder in your back, you don't solder it the opposite way. It's got to be this way. So that's why you mark it number one, remove it, and then put the original chip on this one, solder it. And before you solder it, you gotta make sure you can read the numbers right, which is I can read 30132 as I marked it here. I solder it back, put it all together, and your car will start. So that's how you basically swap the chips, doll security information all in there, and then just put it together and start the car. You might need to run uh, write the VIN to pass DQ, but you have to do that with the other computer. Otherwise, clone it get the information from one to another on the chip and don't even need to have a programmer to do that or if you don't want to do this you can go to Carmen with a K K R M A N Auto dot com and they can do this for you for a hundred bucks clone it program it whatever it's hundred bucks thank you